Well, starting your own business can be a challenge, especially if you don't have any experience. An organization called The Next 36 is pairing undergraduates with good ideas with CEO mentors to build their businesses in nine months. I talked to Conrad listwin Chiselski, a computer science student at the University of Waterloo, and John Kelleher, the CEO of RHB Group. We started with Conrad telling us about his business concept, which is called Kira. Basically, it's a video platform that helps organizations find their best individuals and companies build great teams. And the way it works is really simple. Say you're hiring, hiring for a host for the CBC radio. Mm-hmm. You can simply log on record video questions through using your webcam, and these get sent out just by clicking send and copy-pasting your list of candidate emails. Then as a candidate, I can simply log on, check out your video questions, and respond back with my own responses using my webcam. But the catch is, as soon as I start, I can't stop. Meaning as soon as your question finishes playing, I may be at five seconds to prepare before my webcam turns on and starts filming my response. (laughs) And then you can simply sit back, and rate, share, and compare these response videos that come in with your colleagues in minutes. And why do you think it's important to have that under pressure kind of (laughs) element to this? Kira really brings the in-person interview feel online and saves tremendous time because no more scheduling, no more sitting in interviews where within the first question you already know the candidate is unfit for the position. Mm. So you bring this in-person interview feel online and this results in tremendous time savings and helps you find better candidates faster. Right. Well, my, for the case that you gave as an example, <laughs> I guess you do have to have somebody who's going to be able to sure. quickly respond. <laughs> now, John, this was your second year as a Next uh, 36 mentor. So what did you do? What was your role here? <laughs> so my role is really to uh, to coach the team, to inspire them, and to push them to achieve more than they think that they can uh, achieve at the beginning of the program. And it's a, it's a, it's a fun and exciting role. So I end up, uh, along with my co-mentor, Krista Jones, who couldn't be here this morning, but uh, Krista's a a great uh, part of our team. We meet with these guys uh, probably once a week on average, and we really serve as a board of directors. Hmm. And we push, we challenge. Uh, Some of the meetings get very tough uh, (laughs) sometimes, frankly. But we, uh, we fundamentally move these guys ahead and we, we try to teach them that they've got limits that they don't realize, that the limits they can actually hit are much greater than what they've uh, previously thought about. And what do you mean by that? Well, we find that, uh, you know, at the beginning of the program, it's amazing. We, the students we have are, are real undergrads. They may be brilliant undergrads because the Next 36 does a great job of finding those students all across the country. But what we're trying to do is to take them from being undergrads to senior executives in the right. course of months. And so we're trying to develop their problem-solving capacity, their analytical ability, their ability to communicate persuasively, and fundamentally to build a business in a very short period of time. At the beginning, that's something that they're very <laughs> nervous about, and they, they, uh, they, they wonder if they're going to be able to get there. But through pushing and coaching, it's amazing what we can achieve in a period of five, six, seven months. So it sounds like you're, you're coaching more than just Conrad, right? You're that's coaching right. a so, bunch of them. There's, and the next 36, stand, you take 36 applicants. So that's what this is about, right? That's right. So this, this, this next 36 thing is really an unbelievably interesting program. So the purpose of it is to inspire Canadian prosperity and, and to build Canadian prosperity by building the next generation of high-impact Canadian entrepreneurs. So we have a lot of great folks involved. And, and, and that whole group of CEO mentors works with each team of four of that group of Next 36 to coach them and help build their ventures over the course of the summer. Hmm. So it's really an intensive exercise in mentoring. And we've got an incredibly uh, you know, impressive group of young people. And the kinds of ventures that are emerging are, are just really inspirational. And Kira's a, a great example of that. All right. So what did you learn from John? Sure. So I think John is a big fan of process. And the biggest thing I've learned (laughs) from John is that without process, you won't get anywhere. And so, you know, some examples are 108 plans, um, weekly goals. What we do is we simply make a list of the top five, six objectives that we need to hit every week. And we send them to John, Chris, that we circulate it amongst our team. And it's, it's tremendous how useful that is just because everyone's on the same page and the team's moving in the right direction at all times. Was it hard at first, though, to come up with that list of what the goals are going to be each week? At first, it's a big shift from what I'm normally used to, um, but it's been tremendously helpful so far. Hmm. And so what did you find the most challenging as a mentor in dealing with these? (laughs) 
<laughs> you know, I think there's lots of things. Uh, I think w the biggest leap we have to try to make as mentors is to try to take folks who've been brilliant individual contributors. So each of these guys is, you know, does a, about as well as sc at school as you can do. So mm -hmm. they've, you know, brilliant computer You've scientists. You've got stars. We've got stars from yep. right across the country. So we start with the cream of the crop. But interestingly, what we have to teach them to do is try to move from individual contributor to working through others. Mm. And that actually sounds maybe simple, but it's an enormously challenging uh, transition for any, any person to go through. And that's really what we're trying to do. And I can tell you that you know, several months into the process, it's actually really inspirational that these guys are now running a real company. They have real customers. Uh, we have real board meetings and they're, you know, bringing additional folks onto the team and they're really, they've made, made that leap and started working through others. Hmm. So what's the next step for your product then? Sure. So right now, the big thing for us is Venture Day on August 14th. So Venture Day um, is a day picked out by the Next36 where they bring a handful of Next36 stakeholders as well as investors from across North America. So that's a big event for our team where we're pitching for external funding. Um, and then come September, really trying to build a proper management team and full force from there. Hmm. Well, I hope it's a big money day for you. <laughs> <laughs> I hope they sign checks right on the spot. Good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you both for coming in. Thank you. Conrad listwin Chiselski, a computer science student at the University of Waterloo, and John Kelleher, who is his mentor.